Hello everybody, Max again with Bike Tires Direct. I am here today to talk about all kinds of cool new products we have coming in for the spring season. Everything from apparel to bags to components. We've got some new brand names. We've got some new lines from old favorite brand names. And without further ado, I think we should just get jumping into it, don't you? So everybody knows that the more things you have strapped to your bike, the cooler the bike is. That being said, we've got some really cool new strap bags from Silka, a really fabulous manufacturer, everything from components to tools to really cool little bags like this. Uh, this is a two and a half liter roll top saddle bag. It's got BOA fasteners to get you strapped nice and tight onto the saddle. Really super waterproof. You can feel that heavy duty like treated canvas, rubberized canvas it might be. And then we have a really cool two liter handlebar bag. And it's a nice cone shape. It's kind of low profile. It's gonna sit real nice right there in between your drop bars. Easy on and off with these little clicky systems, little strap that comes on the inside. I personally, uh, you know, I have things falling out of my pockets all the time. Sweatshirt pocket, jacket pocket, pant, everything. So the more little stash boxes, the more little places I have to squirrel things away when I'm actually on my bike, the easier it is for me to get from point A to point B. If you're a commuter, if you're looking for a nice little day pack for a little bike trip up and down the trail, these are definitely a good way to go. Moving on, we've got the new Garmin Forerunner 165 and 165 Music. Everybody loves Garmin. Garmin makes really fabulous products. They're really stylish. They're really durable. Both of these come in a beautiful 1.2 inch AMOLED screen. Both of them are touchscreen, which is also really cool. There's no reason to just have buttons uh, in this day and age. The difference between the 165 and the 165 Music is that the music has the ability to connect to your Amazon Prime, your Spotify, your Deezer, for all you Deezer users out there, accounts. And that way you have all of your music, your favorite workout mixes on your wrist instead of having to strap your phone to your back pocket or something when you're running around. Uh, both feature a battery life of 11 days in smartwatch mode, and both have every standard Garmin feature we've all come to love, you know, GPS, fitness tracking, sleep tracking, everything that comes with a smartwatch these days. So check them out if you'd like good body metrics and a fun little toy. We've got the new SRAM Maven disc brakes. Front, rear, bleed kit, standard stuff for disc brakes. But what makes these cool, oh, by the way, real quick, Maven is a Yiddish word that means like genius or, or top of your field or something like that. So if they're trying to tell us something, it means that these are the Maven of brakes. These are going to be the top of the field of brakes. These are designed to stop. These are designed so that you do not go forward anymore. You just say, Max, those are brakes. That's obviously what they're designed for. A minimum of 180 millimeter rotor is required for these. Everybody's used to having like 160 or 140 on their road bike or on their gravel bike. And that's fine for normal conditions, but when you're really like tearing up a mountainside, tearing up some dirt tracks, and you need to stop, you need a big rotor and you need a powerful brake. Accordingly, you're gonna need, these require, not just need, these require the Maxima hydraulic fluid. This stuff is designed to get hot and this stuff is designed to work at higher pressures. So if you don't use this stuff, these are not going to be as strong as they should be. Gotta use the Maxima oil. And you'll notice that these also don't have cooling fans on their pads, which is a little odd. But again, these ones are also designed to work hot. Wouldn't worry about it too much. Nice low profile design cool matte black finish with a little chrome. These are going to be a game changer for your downhill game. Front, rear, bleed kit, mineral oil, check out the whole kit. Everything's gonna be on the site. <laughs> if you have any questions about compatibility or if you have any questions about specs, go check out the product page. So, next thing we have to talk about today is this brand new line of products for us, the Kogel High Quality Bearings. These are going to be really fabulous high-end uh, ceramic bearing parts that come in a beautiful color. Look at that. The first thing you obviously notice is that stunning gold motif. Look at this one too, oof. So if you are into, you know, if you have a colorway going for your bike that this would pop with, that's a selling point in and amongst itself. Like these are really gorgeous pieces. Beyond that, the ostensible beauty, ceramic parts, we got, uh, by the way, uh, the derailleur cage, the oversized derailleur cage, pulley set, and a bottom bracket, threaded bottom bracket. So at the end of the day, the benefit of ceramic bearings over stainless steel bearings, like traditional bearings, you're gonna see skateboard wheels, you're gonna see everywhere since they were invented for the most part. 
Stainless steel, despite its durability, is going to be, you know, it's, it's still a metal. Over time, it's going to get a little warped, it's going to get a little corroded, it's going to get a little oxidized, and that's going to affect how the bearings end up going. Ceramic, you don't really have those problems. Ceramic doesn't rust. Ceramic doesn't warp over time when it gets heated, uh, and it's a lot less inclined to fall apart. So, despite being beautiful, what you have here are products with an extended lifespan, a lot less maintenance, and a lot higher bang for your buck. So, if you wanted to check out these or any of the other cool new products we have from this fabulous company, Kogel, go ahead and just search Kogel on the website. Should be able to bring up pretty much everything that we stock from them. Our friends at Vittoria Tires have issued a couple of new lines. The first is the Corsa Pro, the new Corsa Pro Speed. These are gonna be a classic racing tire. Nice and slick, super good contact. What we got here? Maximum pressure of 130 PSI with a tube, 115 if you're running it tubeless. And one of my favorite things about Vittoria in general, both of these seem to have that same quality. One of my favorite things about Vittoria is the use of graphene. Now, it's kind of a buzzword, but I remember, I think it was in a few years, uh, several years ago, when the, the person who discovered graphene, invented graphene, that's also kind of up for debate, uh, <laughs> won the Nobel Prize for figuring it out, let's say. It's like a superconductive material, you know? And so these would make great electrical wires. <laughs> ah, waka, waka. <laughs> these ones, these right armor, these ones are cool. You can just look at it, you can see it's gonna be tough. These are gonna be a rival to Continental's gator skins. Everybody loves gator skins, but these ones are gonna be offering you just as much puncture resistance, the little bit lower rolling resistance, which is really cool. You can see that tread is just gonna fly once it hits the hits the pavement. These come in a uh, the 700 by 26 all the way up to 32, so you're gonna have a nice little range to play around with. Max PSI with tube is 120, and running it tubeless is 110. Next up, the new Challenge Gravine Pro Series. Challenges are great. Challenges are super fun to ride. Look at that tread, you're gonna be able to do everything from road to gravel with that, and that's gonna be true for most of these things. This one, however, looking at the specs, this guy looks like it was designed for comfort. It says 25 to 45 PSI, which means you're gonna have nice squishy wheels. It means you're gonna be able to roll over everything from rocks to little hunks of dirt to sticks, maybe even bounce off a curb or something on your commute. So up next, we have these MSR bike packing tents, the Hubba Hubba bike packing tents. Hubba Hubba. Comes in a one person and a two person. You can see there's not really much difference to size, which is kind of cool for a one to two person. And also there's not really much different in weight. This one is coming in at, or excuse me, the one person tent is coming in at two pounds, one ounces. The two person tent is coming in at three pounds, one ounce. So for one extra pound, you get an entire extra person. You're gonna have handlebar strap compatibility. So you can see the little setup kit right there. Easy on and off, easy setup, totally waterproof. Get out there for some adventure. Bring a friend. <laughs> so next up, we've got these redesigned Argo X3 and X5. X3, X5, Physiques racing saddle lines. These ones are gonna offer you maximum comfort. They got that nice cutout design. The only real difference between the two is that the three has the uh, patented cam rail material, which is gonna be nice and lightweight, nice and durable. But the five offers you just good old fashioned uh, alloy rails. So if you're a sucker for steel like I am, this might be the way to go. Both of them are very durable. Both of them are nice and sleek. And I guess it's also a matter of taste if you like the black decal or the white one. Up next for helmets, we have the new Giro Silo Mips. You know, everybody knows Mips technology is gonna make it a whole lot safer when you're riding around on your bike. I appreciate that this one seems to have a little bit lower of a profile than some of the big bobble-heavy helmets that we see, especially for Giro. It also, I, uh, it looks really venti. It looks really breathable. And that goes a long way when you're riding in the sun. Super lightweight, couple of different colorways, small, medium, large sizes. It's a nice little helmet. So now moving on to shoes, our friends at CD providing us with a couple of cool new products. Uh, CDs are great shoes. I love CDs. I learned how to ride in CDs. Can never really go wrong with a good pair of CDs. This one is gonna be called the Eagle 10, men and women's sizes. 
cool green to black fade. Nice, easy ratcheting system for tightening. Two bolt compatibility. You, you know, they're they're a, a strong, durable, really easy to ride shoe. This one is going to be the Prima line, also men and women's sizes available. Three bolt compatibility, easy on and off with the Velcro strap and the nice ratcheting system. Super breathable. You can see all the little vent holes coming in. Uh, so these are going to be like a good try training shoe. This one, the Genius, men and women's sizes, Genius 10, also available. Genius are going to be sort of the, the flagship shoe. Three bolt compatibility, super lightweight, also very breathable. Nice ratcheting system to make sure that it stays on, doesn't slide around while you're riding. Can't go wrong with a pair of CDs. Up next in hydration, we have the X-Lab Aero Carbon Wing. X-Lab makes a lot of cool like tri-sport stuff. And what this thing does is attaches to the end of your saddle. I think it goes, no, it goes this way, my bad. Attaches to the end of your saddle and gives you two extra mounting points, you see these little cages right here, to attach bottle cages to. Unfortunately, this does not come with bottle cages, but those are not the worst things in the world to try to track down. Coming up from Camelback, we have the Men's Chase Race Hydration Vest. Now, these things are exactly what you think they are. It's a little mini backpack, nice and comfy straps, got the water thing, with a two liter bladder in it for you to keep water in. That way you don't have to strap it to your bike with the various different cages. Very lightweight, breathable material, uh, only comes in the one size, but that's okay because there's all kinds of size adjustments. All the pockets you could ever need for your cell phone, for your wallet, whatever the case may be. This will really help you out on some of those longer rides where you don't have enough water in the little bottle. Up next, we have a variety of new carbon wheel sets from Vision. These ones are called the Service Course 40. This is going to be the rim brake quick release model. Got a few other versions depending on the specifications needed for your bikes. Lightweight, durable carbon, tubeless ready. These are going to be a lot of fun. Thank you so much for joining me today. I had a lot of fun talking about these cool new products. If you would like to learn more about anything, check out the website, Bike Tires Direct. Click the new arrivals page and happy riding.